essentially the point was, <laughs> people have made bad jokes about my last name, sure, my entire life. You're sure, you're sure, you're sure, you're sure. My math teacher, every single day, and I had a fake laugh to it every single time. So I spent all week trying to think of a funny name with my last name, and as much with most of my jokes, they just end in some dirty, horrible way. But this is the best I could come up with. The only way to make my last name funny, um, the first step, is first I have to get AIDS. Yes, I have to first get AIDS. Then I have to go to the doctor because I have to find out that I have AIDS. And I go and I get the test done. Uh, hopefully that's done. And the uh, doctor gets my results and he looks at me and he goes, Zach, I got, uh, got some bad news for you. You're, uh, you're right. HIV positive. You, you have AIDS. I'm like, doctor, are you sure? He's like, no. You are. That's the best I got. That's the best I can do. Curse my last name. Damn Germans. Uh, all right. Uh, that was a beautiful voice, beautiful singing. I just now realized that. Is, is the baby still here? Yeah. yeah. <sighs> all right. All right. I, I hope he doesn't remember these jokes. I hope <laughs> it would be good. Now, I recently found out who Lizzo is. Woo! Who Lizzo is. Uh, don't worry, don't. You know, I can make th these jokes I'm about to make because I am a fat guy. It's like being gay with the F word, it's very liberating. And um, all I know about her is that whenever she posts a revealing picture online, half the people are going, Bleh! and then the other half people are saying, this is very inspiring in how you know, she's showing um, self-confidence in who you are. You know, every single time she, you know, is shaking her ass at an RBs, people are praising her for it. And that's a fact I do find that good. But every single time I shake my ass, <laughs> all that happens is I have my priest yelling at me saying, get off stage! <laughs> Too old to be doing that. Ugh. Yeah. Um, so don't, uh, I pulled a prank on my girlfriend recently. I uh, poked three holes in her condom. Well, my condom, I guess. And uh, you guys will never believe what happened. Uh, she got pregnant, and she gave birth to a uh, baby predator. <laughs> If someone got that, I'd be shocked. Did anyone get that? No. All right. Three, oh, three holes. Three dots. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's why I was writing a joke today. I, I should have got that earlier. Sorry. And, no, no, that's fine. <laughs> and, anyways, last night was, yeah, I started to get suspicious uh, after the 13th abortion attempt. <laughs> Had a feeling there was an armored uh, extraterrestrial in there. Uh, I, I was expecting a boy, to be honest. I was expecting the, a boy to grow up to be a predator, not to be born though. All right. Uh, uh, I bought a flashlight recently to clean up the act. Uh, everyone here knows what a flashlight is. Also called a pocket pussy, which I think is a better name, you know? More straight to the point. Pocket pussy. Got it. Flashlight. Flesh? All right. But light. I don't think that's actually ever held a flashlight. Those things actually got some heft to them. <laughs> Especially when you're finished. Yeah. yeah. Uh, while we're at that, well, that line of humor. Uh, what do you call a pocket pussy in Las Vegas? A wallet. A wallet, because of the whores? All right. But no, I get this thing, and I'm, exci I'm excited. I'm reading the instructions, because you know I've been doing it though manually for years. Excited to catch up with the times and our innovative technologies. So I start reading the instructions. Like step one, take out a box, put it together. Uh, step two, kind of unnecessary. Goes through the whole <laughs> sticking your cock in and out part. You know? I get it, that's why I bought the thing. But it was the next thing that threw me off the most. It said, after every use, please wash, rinse, and allow to air dry. Ah, yes, just every man likes to do after ejaculating. Dishes. <laughs> uh, everybody's favorite post-orgasm activity. Uh, I know every time I'm done, I'm like, ah, ah, ah. Good to go. All right. I'm not doing that four times a day. Are you shitting me? I got stuff to, got stuff to do. Oh my god, I can't make that process take any longer than it already takes. So, I didn't like the flashlight. Plus, you know, something about seeing your pocket pussy dry next to your cast iron pan, that kind of kills the mood, you know? Just really keep it going. Brought to Goodwill. <laughs> They wouldn't take it. <laughs> no. I gave it to this guy and he was like, Sir, I can't. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I 
every week, every <laughs> Sir, we cannot, we, we can't take this. I'm like, well, why not? I, I, I wash, rinse, and air dry it after every use. What's the, what's the problem? He's like, sir, fuck. We don't accept items that have had semen on them, okay? I was like, all right, calm down, calm down. Yeah, read the fine print. <laughs> well, seems I've made an unnecessary trip this afternoon. <laughs> Better give me back that uh, bag of socks and Barbie dolls while you're at it. Uh, I'll, be on, I'll be on my merry way. All right. <laughs> That'll do it for me. Thank you. I'm sorry, baby. I'm